Good morning. It's been a while. I kind of took a break off this week from filming so that I could focus on getting stuff edited. And I've been going through and put trying to put subtitles on a lot of our old videos. Today is day 126. I believe that's what I counted. And it is Friday, July 17th. It's been a really long time since I've been on the boat. So we're gonna go out on the boat this morning and take some of our friends with us. And then Raven has a follow-up eye appointment today. I don't really think that anything is different with her eye, but at least we'll follow up with the doctor and see what she recommends and just go from there. I just wanna say that I really appreciate you guys getting up so nicely today and going to bed at a reasonable hour yesterday. <laughs> Raven, you were asleep before I even came in to check on you. Nothing like a little ice cream breakfast, huh, guys? <laughs> Chayton's got his cotton candy. What kind do you have, Rave? Rainbow. 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 What type, kind does Talon have? Cookie dough ice cream. Yum. 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 That's how they get the boats in and out of the water. All the other boats are covered except for ours. <laughs> Kevin was just out on it yesterday, though. There's the Meyer marker. They make it look so simple. I do like it's this easy. All you have to do is let them know that you want your boat out and they bring it out here and park it over there waiting for you. I have eyes in the top of my bun. <laughs> We've got Hannah. And Ethan. And there's Amy. Hello, Miss Emma. Hello, hello. Chayton's helping Daddy undo the dock line. That's his spot, right, dude? You like that spot?
how many seven-year-olds does it take to, <laughs> to drive, drive a boat? boat. <laughs> no. One hundred. <laughs> Them. At least they're doing, they're doing the oh, right. Wait, turn around, guys. It's not deep. Hannah's like, see oh, there. It's not deep at all. Oh my gosh, it's so shallow. Woo! <laughs> you got soaked. You got home. Wow. Wow. I like, know. Wow. quick appointment and then we're gonna see what daddy and Chayton and Taylor are up to. We finished up at Raven's appointment. Nothing really new. We do have an appointment scheduled to put some prisms on her glasses to see if that helps get her eyes to work together. Just gonna continue and boost up working with the patching and exercises and we're gonna follow up in early October. There may be a potential for needing surgery if the conservative treatments don't work, but we'll see. I'm hoping that we can start working on those 
more intensely to get her where she needs to be. But I dropped Raven off at home. I am now in the parking lot of a Super Target. Tomorrow I'm getting together with my BFF Amy and celebrating her birthday. And I wanted to get her some birthday cake ice cream and some cones to go with it. So that way we can, instead of doing a birthday cake, I figured birthday ice cream since it's gonna be like in the 90s tomorrow. <laughs> she loves anniversary cake ice cream, but I think that the Target brand of birthday cake ice cream is as close as it's gonna get, but it says it's limited stock. So I gotta go see if I can find some. Be aware, this entrance is actually closed and there's signs that it's closed. So if there's a two entrances, one might not be open. They had one thing left of the birthday cake ice cream. So I hope it's enough for five kids and two adults. I am gonna put it in the cooler that I brought so it doesn't melt on the way home. I got sugar cones, jumbo cones, just the safety cones, and waffle cones, cause I haven't had a waffle cone in a long time and that sounded really good. Amy's present that I bought her came. Oh no, it came off the back. All right, well, uh, I'm gonna have to somehow reattach that but it's a talking head twig. Making her a couple of things. And one of the things is this mug. It says cancer, that's her birth sign. I'm hoping that looks okay. Maybe I can move it a little bit. So instead of moving the, the word cancer, I did just use one of my tools and I scraped some of the paint to outline it. That way you can read it a little bit better. I think it is ready for resin. So it's eight o'clock at night and for days, Raven has been asking to make what? Rock candy. Rock candy. So we are actually gonna make that tonight. We have our stuff set up. So we're making five different flavors, two of each. We have red is for strawberry, orange is peach, yellow is pineapple, purple is grape, and pink is watermelon. Are you ready to start the sugar mixture on the stove? Yeah! Are you gonna be safe with the stove? Do you want me to do the stove? Yeah. First up yeah, is to turn on the burner. And we're gonna put it on high. We add one cup of water. I'm gonna do the sugar. Okay. Well, then bring a stool over so you can do the sugar. So we need two to three cups of sugar putting a half a cup in at a time. We're gonna do four of them and then see how it is. And we gotta stir that until it dissolves. We need at least two more of those. I just said to add until it no longer dissolves. It's boiled and dissolved. I'm gonna turn the heat off. We're gonna let that start to cool. And it says for about 15 minutes. What I want you to do is to come over here and we'll start adding the flavorings and the colorings. By the way, the sticks that I used are these skewers and I just cut off the pointy tip and cut each one in half. And it makes a pretty decent sized rock candy stick. We just need to very carefully add just a couple of drops to the champagne flute. Just a little bit. Don't tilt it too much. There you go, that's perfect. That was like three drops, perfect. All right, I'm going to add this. one or two drops. Oh, this? And not squirts, just drops. <laughs> Good job. Now save the pink because you're gonna need it for the next one, which is purple. I did the purple flavoring and it is already colored. If you wanna make it a little lighter, you can add a drop of pink though. <gasps> Very good. Now you need to do the yellow pineapple. Here, let's put a few drops in. Three? A few, yeah. Oh, that's good. Ooh, another one almost dropped. Oh, that smells like pineapple. Can I smell it? Mm-hmm. I smell it. Mm -hmm. It smells so good. Oh, yeah. Add a couple of drops of yellow. Two drops. Yeah. I didn't want my hands to be purple. I know. One. It doesn't want to come out. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Next up, we have the orange peach flavor. And three drops. Yep. It smells like kind of. Oh, that's 
it's gonna have a lot of peach flavor. <laughs> and do a couple of drops of the orange. Two drops. Good job. Finally, strawberry. In the middle. Oh, hey, that one's also gonna be very flavorful. <laughs> yeah, the new ones are going to be a little bit flavorful. Mm. That's okay. This is flavor one. Um, the new one. It's I'll... good to have flavors because otherwise it's just sugar. Keep it over, over it. Oh, see, you missed. Okay, now you can see where you're dropping it. Okay, I think that's good. That was a pretty thick drop. <laughs> so red, orange, yellow, purple, pink. We have our boiled One. sugar. We have a plate full of granulated sugar. What we're gonna do is take a stick, dip it into mm -hmm. the boiled sugar, and then roll, and then roll it into this sugar. Okay, and the reason we are doing this is that it is going to give the liquid sugar something to stick to when it is sitting in there. It needs something to build on it. And then just put the stick Thank here. You. The more sugar you get to stick, the better that the sugar is going to stick when we put it into the flute. I'm gonna pour the sugar in and you're gonna stir with a knife. Okay. Ready? I, I'm ready. Let me pour it in first real quick. Okay, tell me when to stir. So. Stir. It went out a little bit. I'm going to use this side. because this Would you rather have a spoon? I just thought a knife would get in there better. My hand on my knife. <laughs> Here, <laughs> don't poke yourself, but use this, okay? But don't poke yourself. So this is going to be grapey purple. Can I smell it now? Sure. Here you go. I'm going to use the point. Okay. Side. Yeah, because that'll get down in there. That's a good idea. Is that enough, Mom? That looks pretty good. That way we don't mix colors and flavors. And maybe a pink got in. No, I think that's just the color of the orange mixing. Okay. So my mom is going to do it now. I'm going to show what we're going to do. Mm -hmm. So... You want to take, you want to make sure it doesn't touch the bottom. Yep. So it's got to be clipped in. And it yep. can't, they can't touch each other either. Uh-huh. So let's try this. And these need to be, the sticks need to be dry before you put them in. You can see it bubbling. Whoa, so cool. Yeah. You want to clip two of them together, though, because we're going to put two in each, right? Don't look at you using your, your noggin. Let's move it more towards the center, though, because you want it to be close to the center because it's not that wide of a cup. Other one? <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. My hand. Whoa, whoa, whoa. My hand almost is... Uh, a little bit there you, that should be that should be good okay so they're not supposed to touch the sides or each other or the bottoms but it's a little difficult with the space and getting them to stay in so this is the best we're gonna do we're gonna leave them anywhere for a few days to a few weeks depending on how big of rock candy we want we're just gonna take a look and see how it goes and when we want it we'll have it mm, that's a cutie so i wasn't prepared to be laying down already <laughs> we had a long and exhausting day with going on the boat having raven's appointment and going to the store and then making rock candy after dinner and now someone doesn't want to go to sleep so i'm kind of stuck laying here with them and hoping that he falls asleep if I have enough footage to do its own episode with tomorrow's activities, then it'll be the next episode. Otherwise, I'll put the footage right here. Was there footage? Oh. If there wasn't footage, then that means there's another episode. So until then, we'll see you at the next Meyer Marker. Oh. <laughs> Bye.
Bye. <laughs>